Hi guys, welcome back. Um, if you're new, my name is Jason. Um, today we will be making one of my biggest quarantine cravings. I know GCQ na lang. May mga food na parang iba pa rin experience when you eat them outside. So syempre, obviously, bawal pa rin. Uh, most places I think now are still um, nagte-take out or nagte-pick up. Ito, gusto ko na talagang kainin, um, yung chicken wings. Um, madami mga places dito na merong only wings din yan, pero obviously now we can't have only wings. So why not make it a bit cheaper for you for the same amount kesa sa mag-order ka dun sa mga places. Make it on your own na lang kasi mas cost-friendly siya. Um, ayoko masyadong gumawa ng mga wing recipes na common. Gusto ko parang Pinoy style na hindi ko masyadong nakikita. Cause I like a lot of Pinoy flavored chicken wings. Um, for today, I have three lined up. I have a honey bagoong chicken wing. So obviously, the main ingredients are honey and bagoong. A salted egg cream na chicken wing. See the main ingredient being salted egg. And lastly, we have our favorite meron place dito that serves this flavor na sobrang gusto gusto ko na matry ulit. It's called the caramelized patis. So it's honey with patis. Um, yun, yun yung tatlo na gagawin natin today. I have, I think, around a kilo and a half of chicken. All for me. And other people in the house. So, kahit ako nag-isip ng gantong flavor, gusto ko nga mas unique nga. Ayoko nung parang say ng lemon pepper nga or sriracha chicken. Parang. Kasi parang may kita mo sa lahat yun yan. Pwede mong orderin. Ito medyo mas, ano siya, mas unique. Medyo mas mahirap siyang makuha. Shit, I just realized kare-kare wing sana. But it's okay, we have three flavors. Masarap na yun. Anyway, we will get started. Kanina, nag-start na kami actually mag-film because we have to marinate the chicken. It's already been marinating... Ma it's already been marinating for like two hours. And then ngayon, kukunin natin siya. And I will show you now how to make it. So... For the marinade, we will start with our chicken, of course. Um, hinati natin yung chicken wing natin into two. And then to that, we will add our calamansi juice. Uh, it's about three tablespoons. And then we will add our salt, a generous amount of salt. And then our freshly ground black pepper. So when that's good, you will mix it all together. Make sure kahit paano makot. And then you will marinate this for about two hours. So we have our chicken and then we have our crispy fry na breading mix. Mostly people use flour pero this is a secret I learned from a few chefs. So obviously you have your uh, marinated chicken. Toss nyo lang ng konti. Make sure you get into those little crevices dun sa chicken. And then once you're okay, um, shake off any excess and then put it sa plate. So repeat until every single chicken is already coated with your breading mix. Put oil in a pan, make sure it's a deep pan kasi nga deep frying tayo. And then to make sure na it's hot na, you dip a wooden spoon and then when you see na nagbabubbles na yung gilid ng spoon, that means it's hot enough. We put our chicken wings and we do it by batches. Make sure we don't overcrowd the pan. Make sure you be careful. Uh, so, once you put your batch, wait for about 8 to 10 minutes depending on the size of your chicken or until it's golden brown. Um, pag na-achieve natin yung golden brown color na gusto natin, we will strain it or if you have a kitchen towel, uh, patong na sa inyong bowl para ma-drip off yung excess oil. Okay, so we start with our first sauce. It's our salted egg cream. Um, we have some butter. Actually, dapat yung melt pa lang pero soft na siya. And then after that, don't let it burn and... Put in your garlic. Mayroon pa tayong sitarin for later. Ayan. Wait lang natin a minute para maging fragrant yung garlic and we add the rest of our ingredients. Once fragrant na yung ating garlic, we will be putting our salted egg yolk. We have around 3 pieces. Mash nyo. And then, right after that, we will be putting a tablespoon of evaporated milk. and half a teaspoon of brown sugar. Uh, stir well and combine, and then after this, we will be adding our chicken. We will add our chicken. 
toss it until everything is evenly coated. After that, you will be serving it na. Okay. Okay, so second recipe is honey bagoong. And we put around 2 teaspoons of whoopsie of our bagoong. In this case, our whole jar. And then about an eighth of a cup of honey. Ia ay bol ko na lang to ah. And mix both of them together. We will add our chicken. Same procedure with the last one. Just coat it till everything has the sauce and then serve. For our last and my favorite caramelized patties, first we add two tablespoons of cooking oil. And to that, we will add around two cloves of garlic. Same rule applies. We just wait for it to cook a little bit, become fragrant. Okay, now that the garlic is medio fragrant now, we will add our patties. Around two tablespoons. And then our honey. Para yan yung magkakaramelize sa kanya. Two tablespoons of water and two teaspoons of brown sugar. So again, just incorporate everything together. Okay, so nito na pangit kanina pero you have to let it reduce. So pag napapansin mo na makapal na yung sauce mo, you will add the chicken. And then again, same principle. Just coat everything. Oh no, boy pa. Coat everything and then serve. Ay panalo yung patiyo.